Imagine this is your dog, Laverne. He's a Dalmatian. Laverne might not be the smartest dog, but he's a good soul and always happy. He likes to play with his ball or go for a walk. Lately, something changed about him, though. His energy is low, and he seems sick. One day, you find him so exhausted, he can't even go for a walk and doesn't want to eat anymore. What's wrong with you, Laverne? Ah, oh, he replies. You search his fur and quickly find a big, fat tick. Ticks are a common finding in dogs, and Laverne has them all the time. You remove it, but the tick doesn't seem to be the problem. Then, you dig for your super lens to have a closer look at his fur, and... Ah, oh, what is this? You discover an evil blood-sucking bug in your beloved dog's fur. It was hard to find because it's tiny and looks just like one of the other black dots in the Dalmatian's fur. What if Laverne has more of these harmful bugs? Suddenly, you come up with a thrilling idea. You've heard of these super pills that can turn a dog's coat temporarily white. The very next day, you can convince Laverne to eat the pill. His fur turns white within a few seconds, and all of a sudden, you can see the full extent of poor Laverne's disease. Quickly, you take a few pictures as proof for the veterinarian. You show the pictures to the doctor, who then immediately starts a treatment for Laverne that will free him from the hairy bugs and help him recover to become the funny little dog you used to know. Ladies and gentlemen, Dr. Gesine Knobloch. Now, our research group is not working with Dalmatians. However, the short story of Laverne and his disease tries to illustrate a very similar problem physicians are facing when trying to identify certain diseases in the livers of humans. The liver is an organ with important tasks in your body, like breaking down food into energy and getting rid of toxic wastes. When the radiologist images the liver in the MRI scanner, you could say it looks a little bit like a Dalmatian. After the injection of a special fluid, which we call contrast agent, the organ appears like a white blob with dark dots in it. Those dots are the vessels that supply the liver with blood. If the liver gets sick, it's usually easy to identify the reason if the lesions are big enough, like here or here. However, Finding the problem becomes more difficult if the lesions are small and look just like the black vessels in the liver. In our recent research at the University of Wisconsin-Madison, we were able to show that we can turn the liver completely white when we inject a second contrast agent and then take the pictures right in the moment when the contrast agent passes through the liver vessels. And this is what it looks like, first before and then after the injection of the second contrast agent. With this technique, we're hoping to make it easier to identify even the very small lesions in the liver. Being able to find these small lesions early on before they grow and suck too much energy may have a crucial impact on the health of the entire body, especially in patients who suffer from cancer. By optimizing our imaging protocols and increase the sensitivity to find all lesions in the liver, the physicians might then be able to choose the most suitable treatment for the patient that will help them to recover just like little Laverne.